We're gonna work on buck and roll from the mount position. So I'm gonna be down on my back, knees bent, arms up. Jackie's gonna be mounting me, knees across the hips. She's gonna have her hands on my torso, which is a good neutral spot for us to learn the principles. Having a good trap. What I do is I wanna avoid my partner being able to base out with that arm when I roll her to my left, her right. So I'm gonna have two on one from here. I wanna trap her leg so she doesn't extend out like a kickstand. That's bad for me because I wanna to topple her over. So I'm gonna trapping the leg. And then I wanna bridge my hips up as high as I can. And once I get to the apex, I'm gonna roll her over to her back. So roll from there. And now I'm in the guard position. Couple quick tips on uh, buck and roll from the mount. One is, is controlling that arm. If able to, if you can come up from here and pull your partner down and get her elbow closer to the floor, it's gonna be easier, of course, because now her head and body weight's closer. And then number two, from there is oftentimes students will, won't keep that foot, that, that trap in long enough. So as they go to buck and roll, they'll move that leg and then the partner will slip out. So you gotta make sure you keep that in because the person on top is definitely gonna to wanna to base out. So let's do it from this one. I'm gonna really pull that person in tight and then keep that trap nice and good from there as I push up and over.